Hello and welcome to our eighth video in the series on automotive sensors. In this series, we will explain the function and working of each automotive sensors in detail. Today we'll learn all about the camshaft position sensor. This little sensor is super important for your engine, and I'll explain how it works, where it's located, how to diagnose and replace it, and even answer common questions you may have. Be sure to check out the links in the description for the other videos in this series. Now let's break down how it works, step by step. The camshaft position sensor, also called a CPS, monitors the position of the camshaft relative to the crankshaft. This information is crucial for the engine control unit, the ECU, to manage fuel injection and ignition timing, ensuring optimal engine performance. As the engine runs, the camshaft rotates. This rotation is synchronized with the crankshaft and is essential for the opening and closing of the engine's valves. As the camshaft turns, its position changes relative to the CPS. When the camshaft's lobe passes by the sensor, it alters the magnetic field, causing a change in voltage in the coil of wire. The CPS sends the generated electrical signal to the ECU. This signal indicates the exact position of the camshaft. The frequency of the signal helps the ECU determine the camshaft speed and position. The ECU uses the information from the CPS to adjust, ensures the right amount of fuel is injected at the right moment, adjusts when the spark plug fires to optimize power and efficiency. The CPS continuously monitors the camshaft position as the engine runs. Any changes or discrepancies can alert the ECU to adjust parameters for optimal performance. Accurate readings from the CPS are crucial. If the sensor malfunctions, it can lead to poor engine performance, increased emissions, and even stalling. In summary, the camshaft position sensor works by detecting the rotation of the camshaft and sending this information to the ECU, which then adjusts the engine's fuel and ignition systems for optimal operation. Here are some symptoms to watch for a bad sensor. Rough idling. Your engine may shake when you start it. Decreased power. You might feel a lack of acceleration. Check engine light. This light might come on in your dashboard. A bad camshaft position sensor often triggers a fault code, which you can check using an OBD to a scanner. Common codes include P0340, camshaft position sensor, circuit malfunction, and P0341, camshaft position sensor performance issue. If you see these codes, it's a good idea to investigate further. Typically, you can find it near the camshaft, either on the engine block or on the cylinder head. To diagnose a faulty sensor, you can 1. Check error codes. Use an OBD2 scanner to read error codes. 2. Visual inspection. Look for any damaged wires or connectors. 3. Test the signal. Use a multimeter to check if the sensor is producing the correct voltage. You might wonder, can you still drive with a bad camshaft position sensor? The short answer is yes, but it's not safe. Your engine may stall or fail to start, leading to dangerous situations on the road. Now, is this an easy fix? For many, yes. If you have basic mechanical skills, you can replace it yourself. However, if you're not comfortable, it's best to seek help from a mechanic. Can an engine run without this sensor? Technically, some engines might run in a limp mode, but it's not advisable to drive it like that. What causes the camshaft sensor to go bad? Some common culprits include heat damage. Excessive heat can degrade the sensor. Oil contamination. Oil leaks can affect sensor performance. Wear and tear. Over time, components can wear out. And there you have it. The camshaft position sensor explained in simple terms. If you have any questions, or if you've faced issues with your camshaft sensor, don't forget to drop a comment below. In our next video, we'll be talking about the knock sensor. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more automotive tips. See you next time.